The update is here, and it seems like a lot of stuff is happening in the realm of glitches. Rarely do I ever start an update video at this screen, but a lot of stuff should happen as soon as I open the game and I don't want to miss it. So guys, hey, let's do it together. Okay, dang, we have an info screen, a new way to progress. All current rewards will be automatically collected. 14 Brawl Boxes, 66 Big, 31 Mega, Trophy Road Rewards, and Season 15 Rewards. Oh gosh, I don't have anything to unlock on my main account, so... Yeah, we just got a couple gadgets, lots of coins, 45,000 coins. Hmm, I'm sure that's going to be really, really satisfying on other accounts. But what comes next here? New way to unlock brawlers. Unlocking brawlers. Collect credits to unlock brawlers. Start unlocking new legendary brawler. Let's go. Hey! 1,900! I'm so freaking happy, let go! I had a feeling it was going to work out. Our very first Legendary Brawler after this update that we unlock, no matter what your account looks like, is gonna be at a discount. I just didn't know for sure in yesterday's video, but what a nice surprise, let's go! The same price as a Mythic, come on! As you guys can see here, seeing that I'm on my main account, I only have Chester to unlock right now. And then we can start grinding out those fame ranks, let's freaking go. And if you aren't a where the credits that you will be reimbursed will be sitting in your inbox looks like i get 1370 credits a little bit more than what i thought it was going to be okay really close to getting <laughs> chester here wow all right checking out the shop oh my gosh there's a ton of freebies look at this the gem reimbursement we have credits and coins update reward for free we have free sprays and free credits there in that offer let's go free profile icon my goodness, there's so much in this update. Oh my gosh. Now, with that fun initial look at the update here out of the way, I next want to get into some significant glitches that came out with this update, just so you all are aware. And one was actually quite big. We have this tweet coming out. There's a lot going on today. As you can tell, we are looking into all the reports regarding the compensation rewards after the update. For now, we are still investigating the case and we still need to discuss them further before taking action. Sorry for the hassle. And then an hour after that, we went into maintenance. We are now having maintenance to fix an issue that allowed some players to receive trophy rewards again, which was unintended. We'll follow up with the next steps and more info as soon as we have a concrete decision oh gosh taking a look at an example of why this maintenance went into place we have this user here showcasing what the bug actually is oh my gosh he got compensated i think with the boxes that were along this right he already collected these in the past because of that orange bar but he's also getting all of these rewards look at all the credits oh my gosh that's insane so this bug was only working for like an hour after the update came out i think and i don't know if it actually worked for every single person who logged into the game but would you look at that? They reap the benefits of the previous reward system and now are getting it again. That's crazy. Look at all this. Oh my gosh, this, this video is like a minute long. Look at all the credits he's getting. He's gonna unlock Chester just from this bug here. Oh my goodness, yeah. <laughs> Did he get Chester? Yeah, he's getting Chester right there. <laughs> Oh my gosh, free Chester for this guy, and I'm assuming a lot of other people too. Holy crap, I just totaled up how many credits I could have gotten if I logged in earlier on into the update before the maintenance, and it's a grand total of 9,745 credits here for 40,267 trophies. Wow. <laughs> now, it definitely it stings when stuff like this happens. Thankfully, it doesn't happen very often. I'm reminded kind of the same feelings that I had when that crazy 150 mega box came for like $2, right? I didn't get to reap the benefits of that as well. But I'm going to be frank with you all. I feel like I wouldn't have felt great if I got that offer for the mega boxes, right? And showed it off in a video for all of you guys as a YouTuber, especially, and this as well. It definitely would have helped out. It would have been really, really cool to collect all those free rewards the feeling there but one i feel like it wouldn't be super fun to progress in this game get it like cheated a little bit right i want to enjoy the update i want to enjoy this new progression system and unlock the things with my own effort and there's no way in heck i would feel good knowing that a lot of you guys wouldn't have been able to do that so your boy is sitting in your shoes as well right missing out on those credits i have no idea what the brawl stars dev team is going to do here there very well could be some sort of compensation for it but the majority of the time when this stuff happens 
happens is it only affects a very small population of people. The same exact thing happened for that crazy mega box offer because only like 5% of people were able to get those boxes, whereas the rest, 95% of people weren't able to get it. So from a game development standpoint, it would be very, very bad if they would compensate so many other people wasting all these rewards and stuff like that. Still, I have no idea what's going to be going down here. It's kind of unfortunate, but guys, big, big update and a huge change to the system in Brawl Stars. There's going to be some pretty substantial bugs, that's for sure. Also, I wanted to mention before we move on, I've been seeing a ton of posts related to this here. This user saying, where is my chroma credits? Him getting to tier 66 on the season 15 Brawl Pass and not having any. The way the update was designed and these reimbursements is we weren't going to get the bottom row of the Brawl Pass. I tried to make that really clear in the sneak peeks. It was only the top row of the purchased Brawl Pass, right? So the auto collection of the boxes that came right when you opened up the update was the boxes along that bottom half, right? So it's not like you missed out on the tiers that you grinded up, right? You got the boxes that were there. We just weren't compensated for the switch, right? We weren't going to get double the rewards, right? For the bottom half, at least. So I know it's all really, really confusing and people have a ton of questions and that's kind of what I'm trying to be here for with all of this. So again, while we're taking these first couple steps here into the update, I'll try my best here on this channel with the next couple uploads to address any key issues people are having. So we're kind of on the same page and we know what's going on. So I know there's a ton of very fun stuff in this update, right? We have two brawlers to get into here. We have Chester as well as in the quest, we can unlock freaking Gray for such an easy quest, a much easier quest than I thought it was going to be, right? 50,000 damage to get that. Wow, that's only gonna take like a few, maybe an hour. But I wanted to address some of the more crazy stuff that I've been seeing such as this credit reimbursement glitch going on here. I feel like I wouldn't feel good just bypassing that info here so you guys can expect us getting into the bulk of the content the two new brawlers later on here but what we will do here in today's video is take a look at all the other exciting free things we're getting compensated for the gems here for free 80 gems half off the brawl pass for season 15 we can take a look at these free rewards let's go getting closer to chester there getting a 90 free credits a spray another spray looking good nice dude we are so close to chester it's unreal but next up i want to take a look at these anniversary rewards you get these for which anniversaries or the amount of anniversaries you were present playing brawl stars on so basically how old your account is so if you were here for all four anniversaries you'll get all of them right this number four means your account is more than four years old next up taking a look at the brand new daily freebie going on here i have coins here but i also saw some people get a jackpot roll where some people were actually given some chroma credits out of the daily freebie so we can expect that to come i'm assuming not as often as the other freebies seeing that it was like a jackpot roll there right i mean dude 50 chroma credits for this jackpot that's 10 percent of a chromatic brawler right there from a freebie wow next up getting into the fame which i'm so dang excited for i've actually been seeing quite a few people having a little bit of controversial opinions about the fame for example here this individual not super happy with the fame system going on here basically with the whole premise of not being able to save up your credits seeing that it goes into these fame ranks here right in order to get the credits into the fame, you actually have to collect your credits itself. Like the best way I can explain this is beforehand, in order to get the rewards from boxes, you would have to collect the box itself in order to get that. Whereas the credits now in the game, in order to get the credits to go into this fame here, you have to collect the credits, right? So basically the credits function the same exact way the boxes did beforehand. If you want to save those credits for new characters coming around the corner, then just don't collect them much like we did with the boxes as well as these bonus rewards here. Just get them going and just don't collect them. The only thing fame is here for is the option for people to use their credits on this. It's not like you have to or anything like that. It's just an end game optional thing you can use your credits for, which 
I really, really enjoy. I'm a huge fan of fame, and I don't really want people to have the wrong impression of it just because of the new way Brawl Stars is working here moving forward. Fame, good, right? Not a bad thing. It's not like it's eating your credits and you're wasting them or anything like that. So at least wanted to clear that up for those of you who are feeling a little bit bad about it, right? But yeah, everyone, I wanted to dedicate this video to answer some of the burning questions as well as cover that crazy bug. I feel like I couldn't get past having fun with the brand new content with just glossing over it, right? <laughs> the next upload, you can expect having a bit more fun with the brand new content in this update, the two new brothers, the new gears, and all that fun stuff. So make sure to stay tuned for that, as well as be sure to let me know in the comments down below some of the stuff that you're still confused about that I could address and help out the entire viewership here on the channel if they do have that same question. I want to be a resource that helps you guys out here with this new way to play Brawl Stars here. So yeah, try to be here for you guys. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to slap a like on it. Really appreciate that. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. Keep on following Brawl Stars and we'll see you all in the next one. Adios and take care. Whew.